So what up guys, it's Warp Slink of Venom. No, it's not this video. If you clicked on the video, you know why you're here. It's for his bike. <laughs> so let's do this real quick. This is not a speed build, I apologize. I did a speed build on two other, um, what other video? Two? Yeah, two others before. I just speed build on this one. Um, speed builds may not be a thing anymore with me. There's his bike. Ooh. Look at that red. Black. Red. Black. More black! That's it. <laughs> so, let's build this and then we'll be back. And it took me about 25-30 minutes to get it done. Um, I'm not putting on the stickers because I already did that sticker. It ripped right there. But those are just, like, they're not connected. Which I thought they were, and they're supposed to go in there, which I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to paint that later. Um, you get these. As extras, they go right there, but you can switch them out, and we can do this lovely contraption. So everything has a place. On the bike. So. The two larger guns go on the bomb. The handguns go there. Rocket launcher attaches there. The swords attach there. The knife's attaching there. So like that. And. Yeah. If you want to do it that way. But I do want to get him on the bike. So, let's grab our snake eyes. Remove said katanas. Remove hands with swords. Grab the Snake Eyes box. Find the hand, those hands that have that little circular, yeah, those hands. Secure the hands. I mean, you can just have like one hand be the bike hand, I suppose. Then looks like we just do that. Do that. Get him settled. Have him lean forward a little bit, I suppose, so let's get his legs a little bit more bent. Drop him like that, let's turn on the light, that way we can see what we're doing. So I guess... He's supposed to sit down like okay of course that goes flying off we'll get that back on here in a minute go on touch the hell the hell 
Okay, hold on. I need to That's not even the Kamal. Ooh. I swore God was his hand. Or am I wrong? Ow. So it's not those hands. It's the hands with the swords that we need. So I had the right idea of just... Wrong freaking... Dimension. Don't yell at me. Sorry. Midnight is right next to me on the floor yelling at me because I'm doing something and she's not being involved. She hates that. What she has to do. So apparently it's those hands. So we will slide that in. Ugh. Come on. Ugh. Get that hand back on there. There we go. Same thing over here. Come on. Ha. Oh. Do that. Straighten out his arms a little. <laughs> that needs to go inwards, not the entire hand coming off. There we go. Okay, so. Yeah, drop that like so. Train them up just a bit more. A bit more. I don't know. I don't think he can get any more straight, but. It shows him a little bit further back on the bike, so. Let's try and get the shoulders a little bit. There we go. That looks a bit better. Like so. Uh, tires do <laughs> spin. This piece always is falling off. I'm going to probably have to super glue it back on. Hold on. Yep, do 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 do. The hill, man. And both sides fell off. Well, I'll put those back on here a little bit. So, you get the gist. So, like I said, you do get weapon storage. So, that's it. That's it. Where's someone that. Oh, no. What? That's not one of the swords. That isn't. There we go. And then this lovely beauty. You pick a sword there. Pick a sword there without the blade falling out of there. And then, somehow, some way, you're supposed to have it attached right there, which I'm kind of having a lot of times seeing that happening. Unless you have to hold on. Ooh. Rotate it. I think it goes that way now. Have it like that. 
don't know, but it's supposed to sit right there. Give me a quick sec. I'm gonna look at the instruction and make sure I'm doing it right. Okay, so looking at it. Yeah, it's supposed to go like this. Touches like that. Slide it in like that. Okay, that's pretty cool how the swords are being stored. I'm not that wild that part. And then you can take the bazooka, put it there. It's two handguns go there. That's extra cool. And then uh, it's cookeries. Go right back in here. I'm not gonna lie, I think that's amazing. <laughs> I mean, this bike has all the weapon swords you need. Plus, you get four little machine guns on the bike itself. So I may leave him on the bike, but I'm gonna pose him differently on the bike with the blades. So, why? Let's see. We'll take the bazooka. Bazooka. Uh, it's supposed to attach in right there. See? Just like so. And then we'll flip the bike. Drop it down like that. There you go. Uh, oop, wrong hand. Take both guns. This handgun. I don't know what happened to his other cookery. I have no idea where that went. Okay, so from what i seen... I'm gonna have to super glue that in. Okay. So, from what I've seen, if you see down right here, his guns or his handgun. Let's do this real quick. Throw him up. You drop it right there. Look, a holster for a handgun. That is badass that all of his guns can be attached like that. Um, I know. Now what's what gun is supposed to be right there? Uh, this one. It's supposed to be on the other side. Which I think he should have like his guns up more. Because there's a hole. You got the pig in his SMG. And then you just give me a second. Okay. So, we're going to do this a little bit differently, Snake Eyes. Come on, you come off the bike. Off the bike. Let go of the bike. You sit down. But you got a hole right there, you can see it. The pig goes that way. Oh, but it's supposed to slide in there and sit there, and then on the other side. It's supposed to do the same thing. 
there's a hole right there. Let's just go like that. There's no hole right there. What? How do they want me to put the... Huh? Okay, you guys have seen that, right? Okay, hold on. Okay. There's that. Put that piece out. I get this on there. I will get on there. That absolutely makes no fucking sense. Because you're supposed... To be able... Okay, it's not letting me do it, so... I'm not stressing about it. Um... Grab him real quick. Grab the knife, and it just drops in like so. The other knife's supposed to drop in there too. Grab his handgun. Handgun drops right there. I'm gonna get the side piece dealt with real quick. So I probably have like um, let's see, two or three spots I got super glue. No. But yeah, you guys get the gist of how it is. I really like it. Uh, to be honest, it is my first vehicle build. But I may have Snake Eyes riding on it back over where he was. Ah. Uh, I lost his cookery knife. I don't know where that went. I'll find it. Eventually. Good work. Eventually. It dropped. We'll find it. But no, I really enjoy this. My first vehicle build. And... Yeah. I think it's cool. Uh, but like I said, there's like a couple pieces on that I have to glue down or super glue on because they keep on popping off. Uh, the two side panels on the back and then those. I'm gonna have to oh, super glue down. But to be honest, 
and my honest opinion about this. Stop pulling over from my first, well, second step because I had a baby from Supernatural that is unfinished and sitting in my closet. God forbid, I'm like, I want to try a vehicle, and now I remember why I don't do vehicles. This was actually pretty straightforward and simple, which I enjoyed. And the front tire just popped off. What the hell, man? I am not super gluing all you together. I don't want to make a giant blob mess out of this uh, motorcycle. Would you stop pulling off? Yeah, I'm the super glue pieces on because I don't want to go like, oh, I want to move you and next, you know, things just start popping off. But I really enjoyed it. It was simple. It was easy. There's a select few areas that I got lost on that I had to go back and look into. Uh, the only main issue I am had was the tires. They wouldn't stay connected, so I had to super glue them because they're just straight two pieces of plastic that you snap together. And for some reason, it was not one to stay together. Yes, I'm putting snake eyes on the motorcycle with a katana out. Because snake eyes is my favorite freaking G.I. Joe character. I mean, come on, he's a ninja. One that doesn't talk. Uh, that reminds me of the new, that the Snake Eyes movie that came out kind of had me grr. Because throughout G.I. Joe, Snake Eyes never freaking talked. And it's irritating. That he, yeah. Now, I didn't care much for the movie, to be honest. I really didn't care much for it at all. But, uh, <laughs> that piece keeps on pulling off. Whatever. The wheels, wheels do rotate. So, that makes me happy. Uh, but it's not that soft plastic, it's hard plastic. So, there's that. So, this doesn't really rotate. It's more for keeping the bike up. So, you, that's something that I could have done without. They could have just made a kickstand. So, that. But, hey. It is what it is. I'm just happy that I got this. I got Snake Eyes. We got Soundwave. But, this is your Sling of Venom. This is the... What the hell is this? The Flame Toys Jojo Speed Cycle Mall, Mall Kit for Snake Eyes. Snake, Eye, Snake Eyes is a motorcycle. They're easy, simple. He looks like a badass. That's all that matters. He's a badass. Um, this is your web sling venom. Just remember, hit that thumbs up, bell icon, and subscribe button. We'll be back with more videos. Who knows where? And, uh,